So, round pistons. They're really helpful for making extremely realistic LEGO engine models, but how good are they when it comes to a vacuum engine? I've seen it done before, but I wanted to try it for myself, and I only just recently got the parts to do it, so that's what we're going to be doing today. The first engine I want to try is a 6x6 round cylinder with a flathead layout. So the engine does run, but it is very slow, and there's a reason for that. If you've ever seen these 4x4 macaroni bricks, you've probably noticed the holes on the sides. These holes create large leaks within the cylinder and cause the engine to run slowly. Luckily there is a fix for this using LEGO parts. If you use these arches, you can create a sleeve that goes around the outside of the cylinder and creates a really good seal. So the next engine I want to try is the exact same engine, but with this sleeve on the outside. So immediately you can see the engine with the sleeve runs a lot faster and better. And lastly, I wanted to try an 8x8 flathead.
All right, well, we've determined that the six by six vacuum engines are possible and the ones with the outer cylinder sleeve are much faster and overall run a lot better. Eight by eights still need to do some work. Uh, there's probably a lot I'm missing. I might need to watch up on some videos and ask, or ask around and just get some advice from some people. Yeah, this was fun experimenting with these parts. Uh, I really enjoyed it. So thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.